Good morning everyone, it's Francis again at 7.24 a.m. and one of the one things that I'm most interested in is discovering where Pluto is and what it looks like in our images. Um, I'll tell you that I have uh, the image from, let's see which is which, this is the image from today. This is the image from the day before yesterday and I was thinking maybe this, maybe this, maybe who knows what's going on and so uh, we're flipping back and forth it's very hard to see anything moving I want to line these up a little bit better if I can on and off on and off and I had a hard time finding it because there's so many stars. Look at them all, look at them all, and I'm looking around. And now, look at this little one right here. Well, look at all the stars over here, but let's look at this right here. And we're going to go back and do astrometry on it, but... What? What? We'll go back and auto-adjust everything. Go back and auto adjust everything. This is what it looked like normally before I did any contrast. Very hard to see anything. We just flip back and forth. There it is. At least that's what I think. We're going to have to do astrometry on it. And sucker mood. Definite movement. So because everything is staying there. Let's just look at this one right here. Look at that one. It's still dim right there. Let's find another one. Let's find uh let's use this one here. Right there. It's steady. Nothing moving. Everything matches up. I've got a mover. And I'll be able to compare because these are just the JPEGs. Amazing as that seems, everything else stays the same. I'm going to darken it up a little bit. Wind it up a little bit. I'm going to darken it up a little bit. Well, we can go to the uh, reverse scale too. See what shows up there. Boop. And it's totally just. Is it? What's this? Does it end up there? No. I just wonder if it moves from there to there. Okay. Let's do this. Of course, I'm gonna have to check. We're going to have to check everything. Everything will have to be checked. If these are really blotchy. I know it's really blotchy, but we're taking uh, images of a, of a place far, far away. This one was better. It's very dark there. seems to be sinking down a little bit so we're going to raise it up I want everything shows are good there this is uh, three days Say, but I really don't see anything. And anyways, it totally disappears there. Oh, let's see. Now look. What's this? I don't see anything here. I see it here. What's that? Maybe it doesn't go up. Maybe it goes from there. Huh. I thought it was moving up, but it could move because there's nothing there. 
now it's there instead of here huh huh nothing there let's see what else here one two three what else is there because that looks one two one two Huh. Interesting. I thought it was moving up. It appears it's moving over here. Yeah, you try finding these things. Let's get back to auto adjust on this. Just on this. Okay. Definitely not there. Definitely not there. I'd say it moved over here. I thought it was moving up, but it's not. It's moving aside. Okay. See this blotchy here. Let's color it, let's darken it up a little bit. I see I see a little little something here. So I think this is this is the, the longer one, 120 seconds, you see a lot more stars. This is 30 or 60 seconds, though it picked up the dot very well. closer we're going to do the astrometry submit these when they come in to get the astrometry find out that is uh, pretty pretty I mean everything else is still there I guess I can turn this down let's auto adjust this just darken it up a little bit see anything else moving with it. See, this got moons, and I'm interested in finding out its moons and working on that. That's how small it is. We can darken this down some more. So you can see here, it goes right over. There's a little smudge here, so there is some something there. So when it gets over, it looks smudged. That sort of see something there. I don't see any moons around it. Let's um, let's zoom in.
Pluto over three days. Okay, I have to, uh, like I said, admit, uh, submit the astrometry, but I'm digging it. It's definitely not there, so wherever it went to, whether it went here, Definitely not there. And you can see that there's some spudges that you don't see in this one. You can just get the hint of spudges there. See, you can just get the hint of the smudges. But here, clearly see the planet. Clearly see something while everything else is smudged. Everything else that we see. See there, there. See, even that. That's below it. And then it moves over here. And from here to over here. And then we're going to come back in another couple of days, take another picture, and it should be over here. Okay, that's it. Pop around for another color.